And there are more survivors, including two teenagers caught in the line of fire inside the Isla Vista Deli Mart. Now today they sat down with News Channel 3 reporter Sharon Roger to share their remarkable story of survival. When the shot started, I was right here. 17-year-old Juan Mendoza and 18-year-old Eric Contreras sat down with me and watched themselves on surveillance video from Friday night's terrifying shooting spree. The only thing that went through my mind was survive, you know. These local teenagers who grew up in Isla Vista were simply at the Ivy Deli Mart on Pardal Row to grab a burger. If you look closely, they're in the middle aisle towards the back. They describe the frantic scene at 9.30 at night when suspect Elliot Roger fired off his first shot inside the store. And I just hear like a pop outside and like some screaming, so I wasn't really sure like what was happening until I heard some other shots come into the store, like several shots. Now between the employees and the customers, there are about 25 people inside this market at the time of the shooting. This glass refrigerator door completely shattered by a barrage of bullets, four bullets to be exact, two of which came from right underneath the cashier's desk, two others totaling six came from the front window. The teens managed to crawl their way out the back door only to be left paralyzed with fear. Like we just laid there, we couldn't do anything. We we're afraid it'd come back. And yet another twist. The alleged gunman was no stranger to this deli. In fact, I'm told he was a regular. Uh, so I knew him when he comes in. I say, hi, Elliot, what do you like? And, you know, uh, he will pay and very kind. He will order very nicely. And the owners say they never knew Roger was troubled. And while there's a sense of relief that most people, including Juan and Eric, were able to escape Roger's raging bullets, one of those bullets took the life of UCSB sophomore Christopher Martinez. Now, Juan and Eric tell me that they're still processing everything. They have since returned to the store to pay their respects. But for these two high school teens, they're just taking it one day at a time. In Isla Vista, I'm Sharon Roger.